You can find your cool in Durham this summer. Well, that's actually the name of a summer concert series. Yeah, and here's Tess Mangum Okenya to tell <laughs> us all about it. How you doing? Hey, I'm doing great. Um, first off, what kind of name is that? Oh, Kenya. Uh, I'm a Mangum, so I'm a North Carolina girl yeah. who fell in love with a Spaniard and Ooh, brought him back home. Like an Antonio nice. Banderas. Type. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> and so, like, two of the, the words that people absolutely love are free mm -hmm. and cool. Tell us what's going on with Downtown Durham Inc. It is the Find Your Cool Summer Concert Series every Thursday, uh, with the exception of Fourth of July at CCB Plaza, which is Corcoran Street, where the bull is, the yeah. big bronze bull near the SunTrust uh, building and Marriott uh, from 7 to 8.30, some of the hottest bands in the Triangle. Bands you pay good money for, but you can see for free at CCB Plaza. What are some of the names we might recognize? The Beast. Yeah. Pierce Freelon's band, oh, yeah. Orchestra Gardel, which is a 12-piece salsa band. That's one thing I've noticed, because we're a couple of shows into the series. People want to come out and dance. Yeah. And well, that's a way that you can find your cool. We define that however you want to. If you want to people watch and just sort of hang back a little bit, that's great. But if you want to let your freak flag fly and hula hoop or salsa, <laughs> people were even doing a conga line last week. Really? So oh, find nice. your cool, dance to some live music. Uh, beer is provided by Bull City Burger and Brewery. Yeah. And you can bring kids, you can bring your dogs, find your cool. You know, that was one of the things I was thinking when we first started talking about this is that our kids are kind of only exposed to the stuff that you hear on the radio or mm -hmm. stuff that we have in our own personal collections or right. that we learn from iTunes. And it's the same stuff over and over again. It's mm -hmm. great to go out to a festival like this and to hear so many different styles of music. Uh, tell everybody what kind of different styles there are. Well, uh, it was really important to Downtown Durham, Inc. that the concert series reflect the diversity of Durham and of the Triangle. And we've got such a deep talent pool to choose from in terms of music in the community. I had no problem like this <laughs> coming up with a little bit of soul, a little bit of salsa, a little bit of Americana, rockabilly, pop, a little African. bit of something. For, yeah, yeah, African Cora player who was just nominated for, actually won an Emerging Artist Award. Uh, so you really can't say, oh, I don't like that kind of music because I've got a little bit of everything right. for everybody. What was the inspiration behind this? What, what spurred Downtown Durham to, to do this? Well, Downtown Durham Inc. also wants people to explore the shops and bars and restaurants and retail opportunities down there. So you could just park, come a little bit early, walk around, get a drink somewhere, grab some supper, maybe bring a burger to the plaza. You know, you can maybe make a picnic for yourself. But there's new places opening up every week, literally cupcake shops and bars and restaurants. You know, Durham was just nominated, sorry, again, one. One. one uh, Southern town. Living, yeah, yeah. So uh, it's true to its name, and we're opening up new places all the time. So. And, and also uh, America's number one creative class metro. Yes. That is so cool. That's yes. amazing. Again, and define creativity the way you want to. You might be a video game designer, you might be a dancer, choreographer, arts administrator, concert promoter. Creativity comes in all kinds of ways and shapes. You can also just be a musician playing the series. Yeah. So if we come out, will your Latin husband teach us how to salsa? <laughs> he's not much of a dancer. No? Yeah, but uh, he's a good cook. Oh. So that oh. ties right back into Durham's reputation. Nice. And That's this cool. is a great space. I was just there over the weekend for Bimbe. Yeah. And it's a great space to actually, I mean, there's some grass. The kids can run around and play. Mm -hmm. Or you can stand on the pavement and, and watch the band. So it's right. a really great large space to enjoy a concert, isn't it? Exactly. And our rain location is always the pinhook. So even if you see some cloudy skies that day, there's still going to be music that night for free. We'll just go right around the corner to Main Street to a place called the pinhook. So the concert's ongoing and it will wrap up? In uh, second week of August. Fantastic, Tess. Thank you. Thank you so much, y'all. And if you want a full list of where you can find all the bands and everything, you can go to downtowndurham.com.